are at 7,000 feet on the western slope of the Sierra Nevadas in California lies an ancient grove of giants. The sole species of the genus Sequoia dendron gigantis, nature's colossi can live up to 3,000 years and are the largest living creatures on the planet. Yet due to changes in the Earth's climate, they have been reduced to an area less than 60 square miles. Experience a mythical wonder of the natural world here on Kings of Sequoia. General Grant tree, third largest tree in the world. Very fat. We are just passing some We're at right, Trail of the Hundred Giants in Sequoia National Forest. Dark. Just a little hole. It's the first of the human. He's just coming out of the giant sequoia now. Cross. And it actually fell right over the bridge, crossing over a dead fallen sequoia on the way down to Big Stump. Here we made it to Big Stump, the Mark Twain Stump. saw a bear about two minutes before we got to where they were, but we did not see anything. Dead giant or a dead giant. It's definitely dead in this age. So we reached what we think is the top here. The dead giant trail. And 
There's a lake. We climbed all the way out to the point there. Overlooking the Sierra Nevadas. There's Hume Lake way down there. And all the vast wilderness of the Sierras. We are kayaking on Hume Lake now. We're right out in the middle. Lee is just doing most of the work right now. While I'm filming us. It's a very nice day out here. The water temperature is great. We took a little detour to Sandy Cove and swam for a bit. As the sun sets over the Pacific, another day has come and gone in the Sierras. But for the king of the forest, time is a mere sapling sprouting from the ashes of a wildfire. Though giant sequoias may be immune to age and disease, there is one element they may not survive. Humans. If we continue to heat the planet past the point of no return, these marvels of nature will be some of the first casualties. Only we can determine the future.